everybody. My name is Rich Michael. I'm the fire chief here in Elk Grove Village and welcome to this episode of On Duty. Today we're going to take you through the newest fire engine we've received here in the village. It's April of 2024 and we just received this fire engine 8. This engine that we've got today is going to serve the east side of town in the business park. Uh, it'll run out of the fire station on Fargo. Very similar to the other most recent engine we bought which is serving the west side of town over at station 10 on Meacham. So this is a group effort. It's a, a lot of work goes into putting something like this together. And we've had a, a, a team that's been working on this for quite some time, representing the fire department and the firefighting needs of this apparatus is firefighter paramedic Joe Albert. He's going to take you through the vehicle this morning. And then we've got our fleet manager, Chris Birnhat, who uh, addresses most of the mechanical issues and the motor and the pump and the, and the transmission and the other things that go along with that as we design these vehicles. And he's going to take you through the mechanical aspects of it. So again, we're very happy to have you here with us, and we hope you enjoy the show as you look at our newest fire engine here in Elk Grove Village. Thank you. Hi, I'm Joe Albert with the Elk Grove Village Fire Department, and today we're going to tour our new fire engine 8. Uh, we started the build process back uh, in about July. Uh, we sat down with our sales guy, uh, went through a bunch of drawings, and created basically a plan off of our current engine 10. Uh, so now this is going to serve the district uh, eight on this side of town. Uh, after that, we got notice in late January of this year uh, that Pierce was starting to build our uh, build this engine. Uh, and then in uh, April 1st, uh, the committee went up to the factory, took a tour, uh, and did a full inspection of the engine. And then uh, it was delivered to us around April 7th. Uh, over the last uh, few weeks, we've been uh, looking over it. Uh, Fleet's been looking over it making sure everything's ready to go. Uh, now we're in the final process of the build out uh, so we can put it in service, uh, hopefully by June 1st. All right, this is our uh, control panel for our pump. Uh, we carry 750 gallons of water with us, um, and then we can pump 1,500 gallons per minute uh, uh, total with all of our lines uh, flowing. So each control, we've got a line off the front that we can pump with, we'll have two lines here that we can pump off of, and then there's uh, three or four lines off the back that we can pump with. This is Chris, he's our fleet director. He uh, was very instrumental in making sure that the, the running gear of the, the fire engine uh, is what they would like. So he's gonna talk a little bit about the engines and stuff like that. Hi, I'm Chris Burnett, the fleet foreman with Elk Grove Village Public Works. Uh, myself and others were involved with the ordering of this engine as the 2024 pumper for Elk Grove Fire Department. Uh, this engine was a four-year project in the works. Uh, underneath this cab is the main Cummins engine, the X12. This is our first Cummins diesel for Elk Grove Fire Department. Uh, all previous other engines were Detroit's uh, in the past, um, but this is the new generation of Pierce Fire. As you can see, the engine is tucked under the cab itself along with the radiator. This chassis is built specifically for Pierce engines. These are specced per department based on the needs of each individual department. The transmission which mounts off the rear of the engine drives the main pump system which is located midsection behind the cab. The involvement of this engine was specking the engine 
with fire department as far as the engine, the transmission, uh, chassis, to make sure that the specs they were looking at were adequate enough for what their departments wanted and needed based on previous engines in the past.